Today, shortly before noontime today, in Nara Prefecture, Abe Shinzo, former Prime Minister of Japan, has been attacked and is now in critical condition, as I, as I have been informed. Currently, doctors are doing everything they can at this moment, I am hoping and praying that former Prime Minister Abe will survive this. This heinous act and in the background what the motives are, we don't know the detailed information yet, but Elections are being held. This is a very foundation of democracy. And such an incident took place. It is barbaric and malicious, and it cannot be tolerated. We will do everything we can. I would like to use the most extreme words available to condemn this act. The government will anticipate every such possible situation and take necessary responses. At this moment, Doctors are working very hard to save Mr. Abe. So your question pertaining the, to the impact to the political situation, I believe it is not appropriate for me to address such a thing at this moment. I personally am not currently thinking about the political impact. I am currently looking at this very tough situation, and I'm hoping that everybody's doing everything they can to save Mr. Abe, and the government will do everything we can to be well prepared for any possible scenario. I think that's most important. This is the second question. Are there anything that's already decided for today's response you are going to be taking? You are returning your cabinet members, but what are your future course in the campaign? Well, from now on, we will have the cabinet members, they will all return to Tokyo. So once the cabinet members have convened, we will look at this incident, the current situation, we would share the information as well as the responses of the government and confirm everyone's role. Furthermore, in the elections and the schedules, uh, there are no uh, decisions made at this moment. But first, we have to have a good hold on what the reality is of now and take necessary responses. That's it. So this is from NHK. After the cabinet members convened, what are you going to do?